I felt really good. I stretched really good today. I felt like this is going to be a good race. Local boys and girls cross country teams, including Kofa, Cibola, and Gila Ridge, met for a tri meet two days ago, putting their endurance to the test on the hills of West Wetlands Park. Holding back our top seven for boys and girls, mainly because we have a big focus at the moment uh, is for the Titan invite. Um, there's going to be some pretty big schools that are going to be running in that one, and the, just trying to get them into racing shape for those meets. So with Jose Villasenor resting his horses, opportunities for the younger runners. There's Eduardo Marquez getting his hawks ready to go. Kofa stands calm and focused. Boys team kicked out the 5K event first from West Wetlands Park. That's right next to Castle Park, followed by all three of the girls' teams. Now, during the race, take a look at Kofa freshman Sabrina Anaya. You're going to see her coming up. She's wearing red. She caught up with the boys, and she would win the girls' heat with a time of 22 minutes, 25 seconds. Healer Ridge is Eduardo Marquez. There he is. He took the top spot for the boys with a time of 19.14 and says he could have ran it faster. Man, that was the most confusing run ever. They gave us the wrong directions, and so I ended up running, like, I think... A quarter of a mile more, so I ended up having a small time. I also ended up getting a thorn in my shoe, which was, which was very uncomfortable. You know, it was poking to me throughout the last mile. But overall, I knew that even with these circumstances, I had to push through and I still had to win and really be there for my team, also cheer them on uh, because they were also took the wrong route. With the thorn in his shoe, he still finished great. A wonderful day of running on Wednesday. Kofa finished first for the boys with 21 points. The Cibola girls took the top prize with 39 points. The city championship meet is on October 19th. And that's all the time we have for sports.